Usually when people are going over their resumes, they use their resumes to really enhance and, and make stuff look even better uh, for different jobs and positions that they've had at different companies uh, and different accolades and things that they've accomplished throughout their lives. Uh, they'll use different wording and stuff to make it seem a lot better than it actually was. And a lot of times, hey, you can't take nothing away from people. Their accomplishments are their accomplishments. So some of them just really speak for themselves. But enough times, at least I know I certainly did it for resumes that I've had in the past. You use certain words to make stuff pop. You use certain words and phrases to make stuff look glamorous, look amazing. Because it's like, hey, I did that. I was part of that. That was me. All right, did I get the job now? But with Tyler Huntley, he ain't got to fabricate this at all because it is official. Tyler Huntley is an NFL Pro Bowl QB. Straight like that. Tyler Huntley is officially in the Pro Bowl. He made it. He made, And I'm happy for him. I'm really happy for him because I, I, be, I believe, I'm pretty sure, that Tyler Huntley would get a nice little incentive a nice little bump in his pay i believe um so yeah i'm always happy for somebody getting that money you can get your bread hey get your bread man so shout out to tyler huntley for that alone but now he's in the pro bowl so that's gonna be cool for him i'm happy for him that should help him and i know they're not gonna do the regular pro bowl game which i'm actually pretty glad for because that game is just i can't watch it man uh, every time that i've tried to start watching it over the past couple of years I turn it on and within like two minutes, it's off. It's off and in the garbage because it, it just had gotten so bad. And I get it. Like players don't want to get hurt. I get, I ain't mad at them for that at all. But the NFL, it's almost like they just kept forcing it. So it almost felt like punishment to watch the Pro Bowl. But now they're going to be doing like the skills challenges and stuff. That's going to be their focus. And I think they're going to have like a flag football, I believe, something like that. But it should be a little better. Uh, I... I don't know how much of it I'm still going to watch. Well, you know, I, I watch something to support my dog, Tyler Huntley. So I'm happy for him. Let, 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 let's see how Tyler Huntley got to this position that he's in to be in the Pro Bowl. So uh, Jeff Zrebeck said Huntley was the fourth alternate. Uh, so Allen is out. Josh Allen, uh, he's out. So he's like, you know what? I ain't make it to the, the Super Bowl. So, you know, I don't feel like playing no football no more. Give, I need a break. And I ain't mad at him at all. Now, he ain't say that, but I mean. Take your break. Enjoy your vacation. Enjoy your time off. Relax. Take it easy. So I ain't mad at him at all. Um, now, uh, Patrick Mahomes, he is also out. And I mean, he's out for some different reasons than Josh Allen is. Patrick Mahomes, a little busy getting ready to play in his, what, third Super Bowl? Because he won the first one, lost the second one, and now we'll see what happens with this one. Um, and, yeah, three been to three Super Bowls already. Hmm. Them Chiefs, man, they, they something serious. Uh, but anyway, um, and Jeff also said a few of the alternates ahead uh, of Huntley, they were Tua. So we know Tua, he been dealing with the concussions. And they did say he's going to come back next year. And Dolphins said that he's going to be their quarterback. We'll see. Because I know Dolphins been known to say one thing and then they hit you with a swerve. And I mean, it's NFL. It's a nasty business. So we see teams say this stuff all the time. Oh, yeah, th this player will be back. Oh, yeah, yeah, then we're going to be bringing him back. Oh, that player's going to be coming back next year. And then, boom, they're out. But anyway, uh, and then somebody else who is also said to be getting ready to come back to the Baltimore Ravens next year, and that is Lamar Jackson. So he is also out of the Pro Bowl. Uh, so, again, Josh Allen, Patrick Mahomes, Tua, and Lamar Jackson. So with those four guys being out, Tyler Huntley was like, oh, hey, they, they probably sent him a little text message. Hey, NFL said, what's up, Tyler? He said, hey, what's going on? He said, uh, Tyler, you, you want to play in the Pro Bowl? Because Josh Allen ain't playing. Patrick Mahomes ain't playing. Two ain't playing. Lamar ain't playing. You, you want to do it? He said, you doing right, I do, buddy. And now Tyler Huntley is official. He is officially in the Pro Bowl. So shout out to him. But. I hope he goes there, does his thing. I hope he can make some connections in the league and stuff. I hope he can talk to the right people. And I, I do. I would like to see him get a chance somewhere. I would like to see him get a chance. I still do. I've been wanting, saying that for years. Uh, but I would like to see him get a chance somewhere. Uh, even if it's just to compete. To, like, 
Re- really be given a chance to compete for a starting job Not just oh we're going to bring him in for a QB competition But they really like oh no this ain't going to be the guy No to actually really see him get a chance to be a starter Because um, I think he could be alright man I, I, I do uh, I would like to see him like with a with an off season Going into a season knowing that he would be a starter uh, So that's a lot more preparation It's a lot different preparation uh, than it is as a backup So will that ever happen? I don't know I don't know. We just got to wait it out and see. But anyway, team, keep it clean. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Shout out to Tyler Huntley, who is officially a Pro Bowl QB. Let's run it, Tyler. Go run the show. Go do your thing and take off.